Chatlize.ai is a new app that you can use to analyze your data through chats. So it's like code interpreter from OpenAI, but it uses R um, primarily, and can, you can also use Python. You can upload multiple data files of any type, and it was designed to do complex tasks through the tree of thoughts prompting strategy. Essentially, computational problems is divided into multiple steps. Each step, we go through a trial and error um, process. For example, a problem like this where you have to read the file, examine, clean, and reformat the file, do exploratory analysis, split it into training and testing, and then train and evaluate to models. To do this, you are first upload the data file. Some automated prompts are generated to help you read the file in. I'll just change the last one, so with values of C and V. So start analysis, submit prompts. You can now go ahead and analyze this data. First, check the data structure and summarize it. Then we're going to convert this column into a factor. So that's easy. Next, we split the data into 70% training and 30% testing. So this is finished. And a lot logistic regression classifier and uh, we want the details of the model. This is the result. Notice that you have two options of result. In this case, they are almost the same. Next step, we evaluate the performance of the classifier on the training data itself and produce a confusion matrix. See, most of the samples is classified correctly. And then we evaluate on the test data set, confusion matrix, um, accuracy, and precision recall all behind. We control an ROC curve, and we do that again for decision tree. It's not as good. You can download a report. As you can see, this report contains all the steps, the prompts, and the code, and the result. This diagram shows the path of solving the problem. This is we, we never have an error we didn't choose, so we always choose the first option. Another way of using chat lines is to leverage the power of ChatGPT to write your prompts. So plan, let ChatGPT develop a plan. We're going to enter a very general goal of analysis, name of the file, and then we start. You can see this is the plan that was developed by ChatGPT. The first step is load data into R. Second step of uh, cleansing tasks. And then the third task is summary statistics. Fourth one is to explore the distribution of SP and then correlation analysis uh, of the numerical variables. And then create visualizations, box plot and scatter plots. And statistic analysis. You can see in step 7B, we had an error, so we will not use B. Download a report out of this. You can see this is a report where systematic exploratory data analysis you can see that this complex problem was solved through seven to eight steps. Each step we tried automatically two times. Uh, you can change that uh, preferred answers that we choose. And uh, sometimes, you know, one of the trials is there. It serves as a purpose of double checking each other whether this is correct or not. So this is so-called a tree of thoughts prompting. Interpreter is Python. Our tutor is mostly R. Chat lies is both R and Python. And while our tutor can only handle one file, has to be a tabular file. Chat lies can handle multiple files. And also you can use GPT-4 here. With both chat lies and our tutor, you can download an HTML report. Code interpreter, you can also do that uh, with the shareable report. Not sure you can download that. Our tutor, you can install as a local package. Chat lies in the future can be installed locally. So you have a sensitive data you want to, you don't want to upload to a web server. All of the R Markdown file you can rerun that later to regenerate the result from R Tutor and Chat Lies. Thank you.